In the lead-up to the recent election, President Ma ying advocated that the party with a majority in the legislature, the DPP, should form the cabinet. On Saturday, Ma continued to push for this as his aides met with aides representing President-elect Tsai Ing-wen. And once again, former DPP Secretary General Lin Xiao turned down the idea on Tsai's behalf. With Premier Mao Zhiguo determined to stick to his resignation, Ma now needs to appoint a new premier. Wearing a thick padded jacket, President Ma attended outdoor activities outside the presidential office, marking the end of the lunar year. In between events, he frequently looked up at the sky. Didn't I just hear there were snowflakes on the presidential office? I've been coming here for 35 years and I've never heard of snow on the presidential office. This shows the weather is getting really cold. The weather may be very cold, but the relationship between Ma and Tsai is probably much icier. On Saturday, aides from both sides met face to face for the first time at the Taipei Guest House to talk about the power handover. Presidential Office Secretary General Zheng Yongquan repeatedly called for a cabinet formed by the dominant party in the legislature. But Lin said the Ma administration should maintain an outgoing caretaker government in order to avoid government getting pulled in too many different directions by leaders from different parties. With that, the prospect of the DPP forming cabinet in the next four months has been turned down flat. With Mao determined to go, the possibility of Deputy Premier Simon Zhang taking the reins of cabinet is high. But Ma did not directly answer questions about this.